Mary Brown's actions are manipulative for the cameras of TLC. Mary Brown's behavior appears to be manipulative for TLC's cameras, according to Sister Wives fans. While they feel editing has a lot to do with how storylines seem, they also believe Mary's behavior has a lot to do with how fans react to her actions. How much of the reality star's behavior on Sister Wives is manipulated to appear a specific way? How much of Mary Brown's Sister Wives storyline is manipulated for TLC's cameras? In a Reddit thread, Sister Wives watcher discuss how much of Mary's plot is manipulated for TLC's cameras. Her behavior to me feels like a result, symptom. Of someone who has been through a lot of trauma, we see what Cody has put her through, but possibly more that stems from childhood. For example, there are numerous times when she is paralyzed by decision making. It can look like manipulation, but some experience has made her terrified of decisions and having to live with the outcome. I think editing has a lot to do with how she is portrayed. Did you use one follower? Claimed a second viewer. I am not a Mary fan at all. However. I would never want to be a friend of hers either, but I feel TLC set her up and manipulated her. I can see how fans think Mary is manipulating. Mary's personality can be a bit off-putting at times. However, she was 20% of the TLC show, just like all the others. Wrote a third Reddit user. She earned outside of the show. Unlike others, she has a right to be selfish and stand up for herself. No one else would. TLC pulled the curtain back on the Brown family's troubles in season 16. Over the course of several seasons of Sister Wives, the Marys and Browns began to lift the veil on their polygamous clan's inner workings. Mary has been the most isolated because she is an empty nester, and her relationship with Cody is more of a friendship than a healthy marriage. Cody Brown and his wives, Christine, Mary, Janelle, and Robin Brown, seemed to get along well before the family relocated to Flagstaff, Arizona. However, the family's relocation to Flagstaff, Arizona, exposed some natural cracks in the Brown family's foundation. The move to another state widened the clan's schism, which began when they all moved to separate homes in Las Vegas. Despite living in a cul-de-sac, each family had separate residences, allowing the spouses and children to be separated. Moving to Arizona further separates family members, as some reside miles apart in various homes. The children didn't see one another on a regular basis, and many of the adult children lived in different states.